checking out NPCs from Breath of the Wild and Tears of the Kingdom Part 3. You may remember Bozai as the guy outside Gerudo Town who you could get the sand and snow boots from. He was only nice to Link if he was dressed in the fine silks of the Gerudo Vi outfit. He had two quests that he felt that by Link completing, it was bringing them closer together. Bozai is still hanging around Gerudo Town, but it can now be found on top of the Gerudo Secret Club and somehow doesn't get kicked out even after the Sand Shroud is gone. Probably the most infamous NPC from Breath of the Wild is Magda, aka Flower Blight Ganon. <laughs> In Breath of the Wild, she could be found on the floor at Sandbar and begged that you avoid stepping on the beautiful flowers surrounding the shrine. If you squish a flower, she'll scold you, but if you do it three times, she'll totally destroy Link. We can't see what happens, but it sounds awful, and when the screen comes back, Link is laying on his back and missing hearts. She's still on the floor at Sandbar in Tears of the Kingdom and actually worked with Zelda to restore the island after Sky Islands crashed down onto it. She's still very adamant that you not step on the flowers, but the most she'll do is scold you for it.